now it's time to look at some of the sales reports we have been creating uh, quotations orders and billing but we also need the reporting on this quotation orders and billing and so forth so I'm going to cover that now you can come here SAP menu information systems general report selection sales and distribution sales inquiries quotations orders over here and billing reports can be found here so let us look at uh, quotations let's close inquiries execute quotation list and choose our customer enter company code this is our customer and between open quotations all quotations and my quotations you can choose all quotations if you check this checkbox you will see the quotations created by you only if you choose all you can see the quotations uh, created by all all of your colleagues press enter yeah you can see some quotations here that we created earlier you can zoom into it let me just check I can double click also I just double click Now we can see the quotation coming up from the place where we double clicked. Alright. Now we can go back. We can also filter by the document date if you want to or the material and same thing goes for list of sales orders the report looks the same just press enter to view all the sales orders and you get in a table format you can double click on it and it will take you to the sales order here you go go back and uh, you can also change your layout you can add in more columns if you want to just track from here to here it's like a standard report if you want more selection criteria just click on this button you can choose to filter by distribution channel division and so forth choose them and you can filter by that or you can also filter by the sales document if you want to you can enter the sales document these are the additional selection criteria available and organizational data can also be used you can filter by the organization data if you want to and also by partner functions now let's look at billing documents it's almost like the same double click on it if you press enter you see the system is requiring us to enter partner material data so let us enter our payer and press enter please check entries so let us uh, enter a wider range probably there is no billing data in this range yes now you can see you can also double click the billing document so that you can go there don't click on the subtotal you will not open uh, another screen for the billing you have to click on the billing line item only then you can open the billing document so now you can see the billing document here no need to save the changes what I mean is that this is a total field if you double click here nothing will be open 
so you need to double click over here just take note of that now go back same thing you have further selection criteria here let me just enter the customer code here so that you can click so same thing you can filter by the billing document and so forth and organizational data let me see what else we have uh, all these are shipping related uh, reports you can check it out I think these are the important reports that I wanted to share with you for this section sales process you can explore the other reports one by one later on